Let's get right into it. Wendler's 5 3 1 program on the third week. So, after this is a deload, so this is the first working set, five reps, 127 kilograms, and it looked really well and felt pretty good. So, I'm having some hip pain from my last squat workout, which is annoying, but I'll we'll have to push through. So, here's my second set, 144.5 kilograms for three reps, and it looked very well as well. There's no real issue in form or anything, purely mental pain, which is what stopped me from pushing for more reps on the next set. So let's get into it. the last working set, 162 kilograms, and I think it moved amazingly, especially with using mixed grip. This is the heaviest I've gone with mixed grip, and it just moved so easily. I know I could have gone more, but I didn't want to push the hip pain. So if you made it this far, I'd appreciate it. Hit the like button and subscribe. It really helped my channel grow. So here we have some pause deadlifts. Obviously kept it real light, 60 kilograms, just a few reps because of the hip pain. Then we move on to my third week for my bench press crew program. And the second working week, or second working day, 66 kilograms, 8 reps, and it was only 2 sets of this I had to do. And they felt really good, nothing to worry about with that. Now here are my warm ups for the deadlifts. Now I want to talk about doing a new series I'm going to try, which is 100 push ups for 30 days. So... I love your opinions on that. I'm gonna, if I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna make it into one long video instead of doing it every day where I post it because I don't think that would work very well. So please comment your opinions on that below. I'd appreciate it. And I don't think it would be too hard. Obviously, it's a long stretch of time to do that over, but it's not a crazy amount of reps that are gonna burn you out. Anyway, we're closing in on 800 subscribers on my channel and I want to thank you for all the effort you've put in to support my channel and I'm really hoping to hit 1k this year and get monetized on YouTube and try and make this a job for me for the future. I know I'll never be Larry Wheels but... I do think I have some potential in the YouTube game, so peace out and check this next video out.